Welcome to my YouTube channel PowerPoint University. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create four step animated infographic slide in PowerPoint. Option one and option two will come from the left and option three and option four come from the right. So let's see how to create this slide in PowerPoint. Add a new slide, go to insert shapes, select rectangle, give the height as 5 and width as 2 inches make it no outline and change the slight background to light gray I'm just going to change the color of the rectangle to white press ctrl D to duplicate Reduce the size, say 4 inches, and the width should remain same. I'm just going to cut the, the top part of the rectangle. Add one more rectangle, make the transparency level 240 or 50, make it no outline, and Rotate it Make sure that uh, you align it properly First select the rectangle, white rectangle. And then subtract it. You got this shape. I'm going to give some gradient fill. Two different colors you can use. Use linear or any of the direction you can use. I'm just going to use say a pink, dark pink. And the second color will be somewhat light color. If you want to change the direction, you can change it. And place it on top of the white rectangle reduce the size somewhat and bring it down I'm going to add some text here this is option 1 Select the font Oswald, make it bold and make it somewhat bigger font and bring it here and I'm going to give the same gradient effect. Go to text fill under gradient, say more gradients and select gradient fill. So you got the same gradient effect. Just bend it Okay Go to insert Add oval shape To draw the perfect oval always hold the shift key and give the same gradient fill. Go to home, select format painter and give the same format. And I'm just going to add some text here. I'm just using some Latin text which is equals L-O-R-E-M within brackets one.
and add the title and place it here I'm just going to copy the for the icons from here or you can go to uh, the nounproject.com and you can uh, download the fonts for free now select all the objects right mouse click and group it and press ctrl d to make it duplicate so i'm going to make it four options if you want you can make it five options or six up to your requirement now you have to do one by one the same step i'm just going to change the color change the text follow for the rest of the slides which i'm not going to show you in this video now because it's the repetitive steps change the text So I have changed the colors, changed the fonts, the text and everything. Now go to insert, select a rectangle, draw the rectangle covering the all the options. Make it no outline and select the color same as the background. You can add the same thing at the bottom, press Ctrl D and bring it at the bottom. and give some shadow effect and this one also the shadow effect on the top add one more rectangle to hide the shadow effect make it no outline and again give the same background color press ctrl d bring it down so we are almost ready with the design now now it's time to give the animation go to animation enable the animation pane i'm going to use a fly in animation and this will be from left using the animation painter i'm just going to copy the animation to all other options so the animation is copied So for the third and fourth, I'm saying from right, animation effect from right. So let's see. So option one, option two comes from left and option three and option four comes from right. That's it from me friends. Thank you for watching my YouTube channel and don't forget to subscribe PowerPoint University. See you soon with more interesting stuff. Till then, goodbye.